Thank you so much. For, thank you so much for speaking to me. Yeah. Hi. This was, was this is such an amazing show. We're we're at the tail end now. And so what I really want to talk about with John Baker is one is how is he dealing with everything right now? His mindset also with his wife is how his wife is dealing. Oh, um, well, you know, obviously I want to be as supportive as possible with my wife. I understand that she is a deputy, so she is, you know, very busy with her job and her, uh, her work at, uh, encompasses a lot of her life and also uh, she doesn't have a regular schedule so mm -hmm. um, I think just to be as supportive as possible with uh, everything that's going on in her life even when she revealed to me that um, you know she believed that she uh, had an experience with UFOs I, I just have to be supportive and I have to believe her and just support her 100% with whatever she uh, decides to do right so John doesn't know the extent of, of the aliens that are in in there. Um, what I want to know is if he actually saw one, would he would that further his belief in his wife, or at this moment does he kind of not believe her? Uh, I think at this moment he kind of doesn't believe her. Like uh, he hasn't. Okay. He's the kind of person that you know he needs to see something in order to believe it. Um, so I I, I think. Seeing proof of it obviously would help support um support his belief. Can you tease whether or not that support would be further supported in the upcoming episode? Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, I can't tease it. Um, I don't think you'll be able to see it on this season yet, but um, you will be able to see something like that in further episodes. Yeah, in the next season, probably. Okay. Okay. So then what I do want to know is just in general, he does support his wife. We do know that um, for the season, kind of what does he hope for is it coming to the end of this? Say that one more time. What does he hope for either with his relationship with his wife, him just being a person of this town? Is there something in desire that he still has that's unfulfilled for this season? Um, no, I think... Um... He just wants to live a regular life. There's a lot of like craziness that's happening in the <clears throat> impatience. Mm -hmm. I think he's just trying to keep grounded. Okay. Okay. What does being grounded mean for him right now? Um, well, you know, in the summertime, I'm working my regular job where I'm managing that uh the boat operation tours. And then mm -hmm. in the wintertime, I'm working with Darcy at, at the uh uh snow patrol. So just managing that and managing my relationship with um, uh, with my wife is really the most important thing and just keeping the two of us happy and secure. Do you feel that she is becoming distracted too much because of this UFO situation? Uh, um, it's Yeah, I think that it's becoming almost a little bit obsessive for her because she's... Um, mm -hmm. uh, getting so close to you know uncovering the mystery that she, she's been working on for the last like two seasons and uh you know when you're so close to something you can just almost grab it she's just working extra hard to try and get to that next next step where she can kind of uncover the mystery and uh she's very close to doing it do you feel that John can, pair, can be that second pair of eyes in terms of, you know how we're so close to something, but we don't see it, but someone else who's not really attached can see what we can't see? Yeah, I I, I don't really get involved in her investigations because, uh, right. you know, I'm just like an outsider to, to that world. But I think, um, you know, obviously if she ever needed some, some kind of like support with um, like the previous season that we were in where she brought the uh, the van home, and then we mm -hmm. moved it, and then we moved it to uh, the reservation just to try and help keep it hidden. Uh, obviously, I'm there to support her in any any way and make sure that uh, you know she can continue her investigation. Okay, so for you, Trevor, what do you want for John and if, for upcoming season? Uh, that's a great question. <laughs> <laughs> I think um, you know my relationship with uh, with Liv uh is really strong i just want to i think you know the beauty of like all the characters in 
and Resident Alien is they're all like really strong outgoing characters, but they're also like really flawed in their own individual way. And they're kind of like a, um, it's an interesting th thing to like watch each of their characters kind of like grow either into their flaws or kind of grow out of their flaws. Um, I think just for this next season, I want to just make sure that, um, you know, my relationship with Liv is, uh, continues to be very strong and that, um, maybe we can help, uh, support her investigation in some way. Oh, can you say, or kind of say, tease, what does she give you in that friendship right now? Um, just an honest love and support. That's mm -hmm. what it kind of like boils down to with the two of us. And, um, you know, I, I do, I like, I understand like all the things that she's going through and, um, it can be like a crazy time with like her, um, you know, being involved with like UFOs you know me as the actual person like i i kind of do believe in ufos but like uh the character john I, I i'm not really sure that he does and he um he's getting like led into this path that you know he wouldn't normally get exposed to okay so there's a lot of also a lot of native american culture that's weaved into the show is there something that you've been really proud to see uh the community is is one mm -hmm. thing so there's a um, a really strong sense of community in the uh in the series and um i think also the um how it's presented mm -hmm. for you know native american culture to be presented in, in like a as not just like a side piece it's like a an integral part of the show it's really refreshing to see that and it's done in a tasteful way and it's um it's really good to be a part of okay and lastly for the finale is there anything i know you can't talk specifics but was it something that as a warm journey can you say it it left you with the emotion of warming your heart excitement left you hanging for this season's finale yes I can't say that. <laughs> there's there's stuff that's leading up to the finale that um mm -hmm. I mean, you know, it's gonna um it's gonna be something interesting that you guys have to watch. So I, I can't reveal too much, but um mm -hmm. right. you know, obviously everything is leading up to like this point with um with all the individual stories and um yeah, you got to watch and see how it plays out. Okay, I'll take that. Thank you so much for speaking to me. Thank you.